hello friends today in this tutorial we will be building a toast notification alert messages kind of application in angular 13 so i will be implementing this using ngx toaster library so this will be a demo on the screen right now so there will be a success error info warning if i click but the buttons you will see the notification message all these notification messages it will be pop popping in in the screen for 5 to 10 seconds and it will disappear automatically you will see so i will be showing you how to implement this inside angular 13 application so this ma these messages are very much important when whenever you are building applications you need to be having some kind of notification messages so so for this tutorial i have written a complete blog post on my website coding siksha i have given the link in the video description you can go to that link and download all the source code so you can see this is a so all the source code is present so now let's get started by building this application i will close the previous application and now i will go to the projects directory and here i will make a new directory which will be toast angular i will go into this directory and here i will invoke uh, toast angular so let me make another toast angular cd toast angular so here i will make a new angular js project which will be toast angular project toast project so now it will ask some questions guys do you want to allow routing i will now no, and i will use css so now it will install all these uh, libraries so it will hardly take 5 to 10 seconds so i will be back whenever it is installed now guys the dependencies are successfully installed so now we can open this project inside our visual studio code text editor so you will see this is the empty uh, nodes uh, angular project so for this library we need to install two two libraries first will be npmi at the rate angular slash animations package so install this and also we need to install ngx dash to a s t r this is a library that we are using ngx dash toaster you can also search it inside npm js so this is a package ngx toaster so it is specifically made for angular applications you will see it is a very popular library 283000 weekly downloads this is its official website so here also you can create your own toast messages just provide custom title messages and now it has successfully installed it so we can now launch this application ng serve sorry we need to go to that project so cd toast project and then ng serve So now first of all what we need to do is that you need to delete all this app.component.html code and here you need to write simple heading which will be angular 13 toast notification example. So after this heading guys we will have a bunch of buttons. So this will be for success toast and here we will attach on click so when we click this we will have a show toast success so this will be the show this will be the method that we will execute and i can just copy this for three more times and this one will be for error then we will have for info and lastly we will have warning and this will be show toast warning oh sorry error this will be for uh, info and lastly we have this warning so this is all HTML required here now we need to 
just write these methods so basically if you see error will take place because it cannot find these methods so inside your app dot component before that you also need to go to your app dot module dot ts file and here we need to include the the packages so first of all we will import the browser animation module from at the rate angular slash animations which we have installed and inside this package we need to ins uh, have browser so this this needs to come from uh, at the rate let me delete it at the rate angular slash platform browser and inside this we have animations and inside this we need to extract this package which will be browser animations module so here you need to import Sarah just add this browser animations module and also we need to import this ng toast also so you just need to write import from ng toaster and here inside this we will be having toaster module and again just put a comma and in just add this toaster module so just close this file our file work is done now move to app.component.ts file so here we need to define all these methods so just after this title we have the constructor so inside this constructor we will have the private notify variable notify service mm, sorry first of all we need to define these methods so we have declared this method which is show toast success so inside this method Uh, I will do I will just uh, create a separate service for these uh, messages so what you can do is that you can just pause this project and you can just generate a new service ng generate service and just inside the root directory notification so just execute this command and it will create two files out there and this will be our service external service it has uh, this notification service.ts file inside this we will write all these uh, methods so this is our notification service method so here inside this constructor we can have our private toaster variable and this is of the type of toaster service so now you can see it is automatically included import toaster service from ngx toaster so just write this line so after this guys we will write our first method which will be for show success so these are the methods that we will take so this method will take two arguments from the user first will be the message which will be string that's it and uh, we will now be showing this message through this dot toaster dot success and here you can pass your message that's it this is for the success message and similarly we will have for the other methods show error and again we will have our message coming from our component and here we can show instead of success we can show error message and pass the string message so string is a primitive oh sorry we, this needs to be small and then we will have for info the message will be again of type string so here we will show our uh, info message pass the message and lastly we will have uh, show warning and this will also have uh, the message of the type string coming from the component and in 
in here we need to show warning so now we have declared all these four methods inside our service so now we can export this service so we don't need to do anything here so now coming back to this app.component.tx file so here at the very top we can include this service so inside this constructor so inside our constructor of this app.component.ts file we can declare a variable private and uh, we can name this variable anything so we will name it as notify service this will be of the type of notification service that we have declared notification service so now it will automatically import this service you can see from this file dot slash so it will just write this line and uh, now you are go so here we are declared this method show toast success we are writing this method here so when we press this button we will call our service method which we declared this dot notify service dot so these are four methods they are the service methods which we have declared here so here we can show the success message and here we need to pass the message so we can pass the message let's suppose this is a success message and similarly we can have our show toast error method and here we can say this dot notify service show error and this here we can pass this is a error message and for show toast info we will say this dot notify sorry notify service dot show info and here we will say this is a info message show toast lastly warning and here we will say this dot notify service dot show warning so this is a warning message so now this completes the application guys so no uh, let me launch this ng serve so it is launching the application so now we can test it inside the browser so now it is complete so let me refresh it so now you will see the four buttons why it is not showing app.component 